Hope you're all staying healthy and safe. I really appreciate comments and suggestions on my previous videos. Thank you so very much for supporting my channel. If you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel. Today, I'll be going over how to add drop down list on each cells. Here I have a table with case number, physical activity, and immunization month columns. For physical activity, what I like to do is I like to add values yes, no, and NA. And for immunization month, I like to add list of months, Jan to December. So in order to add yes, no, and NA values, drop down list for this column for physical activity, what I'll do is click on cell B3 and then go to data. Then I'll click on this data validation button. Here for allow instead of any value I'll go ahead and click on this drop down menu and then click on list for source what I'll do is I'll type in yes comma second value no and then the last value separate by comma as NA and I'll go ahead and click on OK now I have a drop down menu over here so what I'll do is in order for me to copy the drop down menu to all cells what I'll do is click on right bottom corner and then drag it all the way down now you can see that I have drop down menu on all the cells and I can go ahead and choose the values accordingly and similarly for immunization month what I'll do is I'll click on the cell first I'll go ahead and create another sheet sheet 2 and then add January Airy and then I'll drag this all the way to December and then go back again to sheet 1 and then click on cell C3 then this data is already selected so I'll click on data validation again and for allow I'll go ahead and click on list again and for source what I'll do is go ahead and click on source and then go to sheet 2 and select all the values and click on OK now if you see the drop down menu I have all the month values here and I can go ahead and select the first I have to drag this cell all the way down to copy the drop down list now I can go ahead and select the month as needed so this is how we can create the drop down list uh, hope you all like this video if you like this video please go ahead and give a thumbs up and thank you for watching have a good day bye bye